I think you probably have a very nice ass as well. Man, you made it. 29-year-old Anurag yeah. Tiwari is here to keep his date with a girl who told him she was 13. They met online less than a week ago. She invited him over and told him she would be home alone today and ready for sex. I uh, made us some frozen lemonade. You did? Yeah. Hey, did you bring condoms? Yeah. Oh, cool. Using the screen name Indian Man 76, he tells the decoy he would give her oral sex because she is young and fresh. Then he asks, do you like anal? The decoy says, I never done that. He responds, want to do it? He seems pretty surprised when I walk out. How are you tonight? Good. Good. Glad to have a seat, please. Well, I had no intention of doing anything. I mean, I don't have anything here with me. Well, you just said you brought condoms. I don't have condoms here. Me. Do you have them in your car? No. In the car, maybe. I don't know. Maybe. In fact, he does have condoms in his car. When I remind him what he wrote online to a girl pretending to be 13, he says it's all a big misunderstanding. I would love to you there. That was not me. That, that was, was not my, you. That was my friend. You say, do you like anal? That was again my friend. That was not me. And who's your friend? What's his name? There was a party going on and someone logged into my computer. There was a party going on. You say that you can do it hard and fast. Put her legs on your shoulders and do it hard. Well, that's again my friend. She says, what's your first name? The answer is Honorak. That's your name. Yeah, he used my name. I he don't know he why. did. First of all, you say your friend did it. Then you say you don't know the friend's name, and then you say there were a bunch of people at a party, but you weren't there. Yeah. So how do you know that this all happened if you weren't there? There were so many guys in my apartment. And, and when did the party take place? Last week. You know, there's more than one conversation here, and, and more than one reference to sex. So either you had a party over a several day period, and people had control of your computer, or you're telling me a big fat lie. Well, first of all, I want to know who you are. I'm Chris Hansen with Dateline NBC. And we're doing a story on adults who try to meet teens online for sex. Now, if there's anything else you'd like to tell me... No, I don't want to let you say Then he leaves the backyard and is arrested. Whoa, partner, lift your hands. Hands up, hands up. Somehow the story about someone else using his computer doesn't come up once he's sitting in front of a police officer. You're asking a 13-year-old if she's a virgin. You ask her if she likes to go down. That was the first conversation. I know, and then you also even asked her in that first conversation you ever been with an older man. Did you want to be that older man to teach her? No. I would definitely, definitely not do anything with a 13-year-old girl. Why'd you ask her if she liked anal sex? That, that was a stupid question. I just, out of curiosity, out of sheer curiosity. I'm a well-respected man in society, detective. You want to meet up, baby? So have you ever been touching your legs, your breasts, slowly? I'd tear your little... I wish he was here to play with my We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs>